to my YouTube channel. This is Shauna and I have, um, I enjoy dolls. Growing up and having a family has not changed my love for dolls and I collect all different types of dolls. And you can find pictures of my dolls on my Instagram accounts. I have Sofa Dolls, which usually features mainly 18 inch dolls and dolls I don't have a big collection of. Um, I have my Pretty in Pink Reborn Instagram account. So for CPKs and my newest Instagram account is Pink Chic Barbie. So today's video is going to be showing you our, our generation. I have a new horse and I have a sled. And with me to help me in this video is my Our Generation doll. I think her name is Halia. I didn't confirm it. I'll try to confirm it uh, before I publish this video. I'm pretty sure that's her name. Anyway, I dressed her in this outfit though. I thought it was the same one like her meat outfit or you know take me home from the store outfit and um, I thought it was the same one and this goes my cat Leo coming through he is a sphinx cat and he will be turning 5 February 14th this year he usually doesn't get into my video so it's kind of exciting for me to see him and oh, he's just adorable and very loved in our home and he is just a friendly friendly cat and loves to cuddle so um, again that is Leo but I have this doll with me, and I think I got both of these items. I know it was December, and I think it was 2018 from Target. I have not seen them at the store since. Um, but what I was saying is I thought that was her meat outfit, but I guess it's not. But I didn't want to go change her again. So first, I wanted to look at this gorgeous horse. As you can see, the horse is white, and this one is flocked. Most our generation horses, which I do have a bunch of our generation horses, if you'd like to see more, um, be sure to comment down below and let me know if you want to see more of my collection on a uh, YouTube video. But this one is flocked like the American Girl doll horses, and it probably is one of my favorite our generation horses, but I haven't even taken it out of the box. Um, there is glitter in the mane and on the tail, and it's a cute little photo there. And I'll tell you what this horse comes with. Um, there's four hoof cuffs, a fabric blanket, one bridle and reins, one bow with a clip, two candy canes, one bag of horse treats, and one holiday stockings. Stocking. So I think that these um, items came out like they were supposed to be like holiday, holiday items, but of course you can use them any time of the year if there is snow. And I do not really have snow where I live in California. But I am setting up a big snow scene um, for Corinne and my other dolls in January. I love decorating. And the decorating I do in January is with snowflakes and um, wintry and snowmen. So it's going to be a lot of fun. And I'll have a video and pictures on my Instagram, So For Dolls. Uh, so this is called The Winter Sled by Our Generation. And as you can see, there's the Halia there and her meat outfit or take me home outfit and her uh, winter wonderland sled comes with a horse sled, one sled trunk, um, two harness shafts, one horse driving harness, one thermos, one fur blanket, one pillow and a pair of mittens, a doll, a horse, the doll horse and outfit are sold separately which I do have and in the picture the horse is being pulled by the Clydesdale horse. So I'm going to take these out of the packaging and uh, set it up on the table. And Pixie is here, but she... Pixie, are you going to join us? Come here, Pixie. And she might come up on the, on the table in a sec. Let's see. Pixie! Yep, yeah, there she came. Um, and there she is. So, hey Pixie! Anyway, I'm going to get this stuff open and show you how it is. So here is everything. And I've removed it from the box, the packaging, obviously. The horse is stunning. Um, I love the mane and I love, the, especially love the Clydesdale look with these, um, what do you call them? They call them cuffs. And look how pretty. So they, you can take them off, but of course... I do prefer them on the horse and I just kind of fluffed them up a little bit with my hands and they're really pretty I think and I, I always love the fur trim kind of stuff and um, 
Here is the little clip that came with the horse. I guess you could put it anywhere on the hair or, you know, on the mane or the tail. The two little candy canes, which are sweet. The stocking. And the little treats for the horse. And they look like they're chocolate, but I'm sure they're not chocolate. But they are shaped in a little hearts, which I do like. And here are the things that came with the sleigh. So I think to do the horse, um, pulling the sleigh, I'll need to put this harness on her or him. It has this little picture and they show, you know, the saddle not being on the horse, but they do have the little red. There's a little pillow and I know I've seen this fabric. Is that on the Our Generation One Piece pajamas? I think it is on the holiday pajamas and I probably do have that. The little mittens are really sweet and they feel like they're kind of like a suede feel and they're lined. I don't think they're going to fit the doll's hands though and they do have, they're connected which is nice. But I have a feeling they won't fit the hands. And of course being that this is pink, this is my favorite accessory. The little thermos and the lid does not come off but there is a little handle. The little um, it does look really like it's fur, but it is a fake fur, which I think most people prefer the fake fur. And then in the back, it's not really a trunk, but this will go down. I guess it doesn't stay down. And then you can put that back there to hold stuff. And this will open up. The latches really do work. And there's a little trunk inside. So that's really cute. I'm going to set it up now for the horse to pull the sleigh. So I set it up and I'll have to say it was a little bit difficult to set it up, not impossible, but the horse was really difficult to take out of the packaging. It's just one of those not very fun ones to do. And those poles, they did slip all the way through um, where I attached them to the sled, um, but then I had to pop them up a little bit and now they're staying higher because I kind of would have been dragging if she really was in the snow. But the horse is stunning. The horse is my favorite part of this set, which did come separately, as you saw in the beginning of the video. I love the horse. The sled, um, it is a cool sled, but it is my least favorite sled. I do have the American Girl sled, one of the versions of the American Girl sled, and I do have, I think I've told you, a Toys R Us exclusive sled, um, which I hopefully will have them out in a winter scene uh, this winter in January, and I'll show you, and I'm hoping you like a winter scene video. But this is like a one-seater, and I mean, or you could put like two smaller dolls. I did not get the gloves on. Maybe if I had fought with the doll and getting her thumbs in there, but they were a very tight fit, and I didn't find it to be worth it. And as I did this, I realized she doesn't have any reins um, to do the sled. Sled. If uh, she's getting pulled, it's just up to the horse when the horse wants to go and when the horse wants to stop. So I may make a little bit of something with some ribbons or some yarn ties to make it look more official. Um, but those are just my observations. Uh, it is a cute set. I know it wasn't that expensive. I don't remember at all what we paid, but I'm sure we got it on sale because it was at Christmas time when they were putting a lot of stuff on sale. So I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed this review of the Our Generation um, Clydesdale horse and the sleigh. Thank you so much for watching and come back soon for more videos and keep enjoying your dolls. Bye-bye.